The otic ganglion is a small parasympathetic ganglion located immediately below the foramen ovale in the infratemporal fossa and on the medial surface of the mandibular nerve. It is functionally associated with the glossopharyngeal nerve and innervates the parotid gland for salivation. It is one of four parasympathetic ganglia of the head and neck. The others are the ciliary ganglion, the submandibular ganglion and the pterygopalatin ganglion. Structure and Relations The otic ganglion is a small, 2-3 mm, oval-shaped, flattened parasympathetic ganglion of a reddish-gray color, located immediately below the foramen ovale in the infratemporal fossa and on the medial surface of the mandibular nerve. It is in relation, laterally, with the trunk of the mandibular nerve at the point where the motor and sensory roots join, medially, with the cartilaginous part of the auditory tube, and the origin of the tensor villi palatini, posteriorly, with the middle meningeal artery. It surrounds the origin of the nerve to the medial pterygoid. Laterally, mandibular nerve. Connections The preganglionic parasympathetic fibers originate in the inferior salivatory nucleus of the glossopharyngeal nerve. They leave the glossopharyngeal nerve by its tympanic branch and then pass via the tympanic plexus and the lesser petrosal nerve to the otic ganglion. Here, the fibers synapse, and the postganglionic fibers pass by communicating branches to the auriculotemporal nerve, which conveys them to the parotid gland. They produce vasodilator and secretomotor effects. Its sympathetic root is derived from the plexus on the middle meningeal artery. It contains postganglionic fibers arising in the superior cervical ganglion. The fibers pass through the ganglion without relay and reach the parotid gland via the auriculotemporal nerve. They are vesomotor in function. The sensory root comes from the auriculotemporal nerve and is sensory to the parotid gland. The motor fibers supplying the medial pterygoid and the tensor palati and the tensor tympani pass through the ganglion without relay. The ganglion is connected to the corda tympani nerve and also to the nerve of the pterygoid canal. These pathways provide an alternate pathway of taste from the anterior two-thirds of the tongue. These fibers do not pass through the middle ear. Clinical Significance Phrase syndrome in which salivation will induce perspiration at the parotid region, accompanied by erythema. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.